Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a much requested video and it is how I got rid of my acne scars. So I thought it was fitting that I don't wear makeup in this video so you can see my skin or naturel. And as you can see, I haven't fully got rid of my acne scars, but compared to what they were about four months ago, there like there's been a massive change. So So I just want to share with you guys what I've been doing to sort of get to this point and getting back to like feeling myself, feeling confident and all that sort of thing. I do want to note this video isn't going to be on how I got rid of my acne. It's specifically on how I got rid of my acne scars. So I will do another video on my actual acne because even though some steps are kind of similar, it is, I personally feel like it needs to be a whole different um, video. So I just want to start off by saying this video is not sponsored in any way at all. I just get so many questions on Instagram asking about my skin. So I thought I would just do a video and address it here. So um, towards the end of 2016 and the start of 2017, I had really bad adult acne. Growing up, I didn't have acne at all like I was super lucky going through puberty I didn't get acne and just like you know a couple pimples here and there so you can probably understand how like bloody confusing it was for me to have adult acne and so I finally got rid of my acne after like a year or so that was like the best thing ever and so even though my acne had gone I was left with pretty bad scarring because it was hormonal it was quite like in dental kind of like craterish and really red and like pigmented and I was just like so insecure about it and it was like fine with makeup on but I'm a person I actually like love not wearing makeup and I honestly couldn't because it just like wouldn't hide the scars and I found when I put like foundation on you could see like the craters in my skin and I was just like so insecure about it I like remember this one day just like breaking down crying being like my wedding's coming up, like, you're gonna see, like, you know, craters my face and my wedding photos, and on my honeymoon, I'm not gonna be able to not wear makeup, and just thinking it was, like, the end of the world. But it was just, like, one of those things I was super insecure about, so I put a post on Instagram, and I went, hey, has anyone had any treatments that work for acne scarring? So it was probably around, like, September, November, and I had heaps of girls message me, and they were, like, you know, micro and peels and all this sort of stuff, and and like I was like oh okay still very conflicted because no one had like one answer so anyway Brazilian Beauty which is just like a chain of like a beauty sort of place they do like all different sort of stuff one of the girls who's the friend of a friend reached out to me and was like hey I really think I can help you do you want to just come in for like a skin consultation and so I came in and my beautician's name is Hazel she's like amazing I'm in love with her she saw my skin and she said for my specific specific skin she said for me the best would be skin needling and basically my plan is skin needling every six weeks and it's basically like this little machine that has needles and it pierces the skin and basically it like helps it remake new skin or something like that <laughs> Maybe Google it if you're wondering. I'm not gonna lie, it is definitely one of the most painful things I have experienced. It's literally like little needles on your skin. So every six weeks was a needling and in between that was like two lead light therapies. So a lead light is like just a light that they put over your face and there's different colors. So I think there's like blue and orange. I personally had the one that was all about skin like rejuvenation. And then also every now and again when my skin needs it, I do a kind of like a tiny little um, like peel and that also just helps take off a layer of skin so my new skin can grow. So before this, I honestly didn't really have a skincare routine. I kind of just like use like generic brands, like kind of like whatever was on sale. So I use ASI products, which is like the line that Brazilian Beauty use. So, cause I go there, that's why I use them, but they have been amazing. So I'll just run you through. So in the morning before I go to work, I put on 
a vitamin B complex, vitamin C serum, and just like it's called rejuvenation day cream. So I put on these three every single morning. And then at night, I have this face cleanser. So it's just the pure potency foaming cleanser. So I wash my makeup off and then I put on this vitamin A corrector and this rejuvenating night treatment. So that routine has been going really well. So that's what I do. Another thing I do is I've been really upping my water intake. I know that's pretty like general, but just something I've been focusing on. And now supplements. So I know what I'm saying probably seems like a lot, but because I had an end date and I needed my skin better by my wedding, I went in pretty aggressive. So I got the treatments, I had the skincare, and I also take supplements. So this one, Ultra Zinc, I actually get these from Elite Supps. So where I get my supplements from. So I do actually have a code if you guys want to try them. So Hazel actually recommended that I get zinc. So zinc is amazing. So zinc is specially formulated to help with like skin regrowing and like, like wounds, like healing wounds, which I need it scarring and also zinc maintains healthy skin and supports collagen production so new skin coming through and then another one is this one called clear skin which is specifically formulated for acne relief skin repairing and healing and maintaining healthy skin and I honestly think this has helped so much in my acne not coming back so I take this every single day. So like I said, I'm being quite aggressive with this. I'm getting my treatments. I'm making sure I have a routine and I'm also battling the scars from the inside out. So that's all I've been doing. And I hope that sort of like helps some girls if they're dealing with like acne and acne scarring because seriously not a fun thing at all. Also just wanted to make a note. And if you personally want to get rid of your acne scars and want to try a certain treatment, I wouldn't just like book in for something like a micro or skin lead needling or something like that. I highly recommend getting a consultation and talking to like wherever you go and saying, hey, can I have like a senior beautician or whatever? I really need a skin consultation and just seeing what they recommend because... I honestly was so surprised about the amount of girls that were saying certain things and then I said that to Hazel and she was like, oh no, definitely not. You don't want that for your skin type, like for others for sure, but not. So I think it's super personalized and I think you really need to like ask the professionals. I hope this was helpful and if you are struggling with acne scarring, I feel ya. It's like the shittest thing ever and it's like because you just like gotten rid of your acne but then you have like a red raw face and it's just crap but there is hope mine is only like four three four months in and like my scarring is nearly gone which i think is like just amazing because i honestly did not think that would happen at all this is my skin close-up no makeup i do have a bit of mascara on and a bit of lippy and also i will put in the description i'll see if i can find the links for those like asi products i think you can just buy them online i personally get them like through brazilian beauty i like go in and get them and they are quite expensive but having a good routine and using good products like why you have a specific goal i honestly think has made such a big difference i'll also link those vitamins and stuff i use from elite sups down there mm -hmm.